Hey guys, in today's video I show you how to install a custom printed Gearshade top on a 2021 Ford Bronco. The Gearshade arrives in a neat little package with everything you need to install. Included in the kit are 10 short bungee cords, 2 short bungee cords with clips on the end, and 2 long bungee cords. There's a smaller bag with all the bungee anchors, and then another bag with 3M PPF in it. And of course you've got your gear shade itself. So let's go ahead and get started. First, I'm using a TP30 Torx bit. Now there's nothing quite like starting a video off on the wrong foot. I'd watched install videos by Bad Bronco and Pickens Party of Five, and this is where they started the install. But I came to find out later on in the video that I don't actually need this attachment point. Next, I'm using a TP50 Torx bit. In this black panel on top of the roll bar, you're going to remove the center bolt. Put the bolt you removed through the bungee anchor and then tighten it back down. Moving toward the front of the Bronco, you're going to use these bungee anchor well nuts they're going to go in the two outside holes. Simply drop them into the holes. As you tighten them, the rubber inside compresses, leaving you with a nice tight fit. However, they do spin as you tighten them, so I put on a rubber glove to give me some more grip. At the front of the Bronco now on the driver's side, we're going to remove this bolt. You're going to push the bolt through the well anchor and then reinstall the bolt. And now you repeat the process on the passenger side. And if you remember, I mentioned I didn't need to put this anchor in this position. I'll show you here in a moment the position that it needs to be in. And remove the center bolt on this black panel. Add the bungee anchor and replace the bolt. And up at the front of the Bronco, you're going to put the bungee anchor well nuts into the outside holes of the three that are up there. As I mentioned before, as you tighten them, they do move around, so grabbing them with rubber gloves really helps. And right up the front here, on the passenger side, you're going to remove the bolt Add the bungee anchor and then replace the bolt. Here I'll quickly show how to attach the bungee cords. Pinch the end together and push it through from the bottom, pulling the loop through the top. Lay out your gear shade in the correct orientation so your print is facing upwards. And then just go from front to back, placing those bungee cords over the bungee anchors. And the same on the passenger side. Now it's time to install the little pieces of 3M PPF film. These will be under the gear shade retaining clips on this top panel. Now 
adjust the center strap so it makes a good tight fit and then clip it over this back edge in the center. And do the same on the left and right hand sides. Your gear shade should be getting nice and tight now. And here's where I made the realization that I needed to move these rearmost anchors. I had to move them forward to the next bolt along. I removed the rearmost bolt on this little black panel and added the bungee anchor and put the bolt back in. I then put a bungee through the bottom of the gear shade and attached it to that mounting point. And then I went back and did the same on the passenger side. Add the bungee cord through the bottom and attach it to the mounting point. Now it's time for the long bungee cord. Push it through the bottom of the gear shade, wrap it round the roll bar and attach it back to the ball on the underside of the gear shade. And do the same on the other side. Wrap it around the roll bar and clip it back onto the ball on the underside of the gear shade. Up at the front of the Bronco, you're going to put the small bungee cord with a little clip on it through the top of the gear shade. And a regular bungee cord through the bottom at the same time. Take the bungee cord with the small clip on it, pull it over the side and through this little hole. And do the same on the passenger side. The short bungee with the clip on it through the top, the regular one through the bottom, Attach the regular one to the bungee anchor and the other one goes across the roll bar and into that little hole. And finally the pre-installed bungee with the two clips on it, you're just going to place it into the hardtop mounting hole. One on each side. And that was the final thing to do. Your gear shade is now installed. The wrinkles will smooth out over time with the tension. And as you can see here, the print on mine looks fantastic. The quality is superb. And from the inside, you can see it's light, bright and airy. You can still see through it. And it's just gonna give you that extra protection from the sun. There you go. Really easy installation, about 30 minutes total. Gearshay did an amazing job. The printing is top notch, exceeded my expectations. So check them out online at www.gearshade.com and uh, order your own custom gearshade. Give us a like, maybe subscribe. Till next time.